वेलकम बैक प्रॉब्लम फाइव डैश फोर्टी टू सो स्टेटमेंट ऑफ द प्रॉब्लम इज दैट अ थर्टी सिक्स ए थर्टी सिक्स सॉलिड स्टील शॉफ्ट इज टू मिलीमीटर लॉन्ग एंड हैज़ डायमीटर ऑफ सिक्सटी मिलीमीटर इट इज़ रिक्वायर्ड टू ट्रांसमिट पावर ऑफ सिक्सटी किलो वाट फ्राम मोटर टू पम्प पी डिटरमाइन द स्मॉलेस्ट एंगुलर विलासटी द शॉफ्ट कैन हैव इफ एलोएबल शेयरिंग स्ट्रेस इज एटी मेगा पासकल सो दिस इज मोटर एम विच इज ट्रांसमिटिंग पावर टू दिस पम्प थ्रू दिस सॉलिड shaft clear and that uh, solid shaft has diameter of 60 mm and that is required to transmit 60 kw of power from this motor m to this pump p the allowable shearing stress of this shaft is 80 mega pascal so you have to determine the smallest angular velocity omega of this shaft so let's start with the solution so what we will do is that we know that power is equal to torque into angular velocity so from here we will get omega is equal to power divided by torque so we have power we do not have torque so first we will find we will find this we will find torque t how you will find this torque t so we know that allowable sharing stress is equal to Mm, T into C divided by J, clear. So from here you will get torque is equal to allowable sharing stress into J divided by C. So allowable sharing stress is given in the data that is eighty mega pascal. C is not given, so diameter of the shaft is given. So C will be equal to D divided by two. Which is equal to zero point zero six zero divided by two, and that will be equal to zero point zero three zero meter. So we have this. We do not have J. J is the polar moment of inertia. So J for the solid shaft is equal to pi by two c power four. So pi by two c is zero point zero three zero power four. When you calculate it, you will get J is equal to zero point four four zero five into ten to the power minus six times pi, and the unit will be equal to meter power four. Now you have all the values. You can just put it in this formula. Allowable sharing stress is eighty mega pascal. So eighty into ten to the power six. Multiply by C, which is zero point zero three. Uh, sorry, J. J is zero point four zero five into ten to the power minus six times pi divided by C, which is equal to zero point zero three zero. So when you solve this, you will get. Torque comes out to be three three nine two point nine two. Unit will be newton into meter. Now you have this torque, so you have to move in this, this to this formula. Omega is equal to angular velocity is equal to power divided by torque. So power is. Sixty kilowatt, so sixty into ten to the power three divided by three three nine two point nine two. So when you calculate it, you will get seventeen point six eight, and the unit will be equal to radian per second. And if you round off. You will get seventeen point seven radian per second. So this is the required angular velocity of this solid steel A thirty six shaft that will deliver sixty kilowatt of power. And that was all about this problem five dash forty two. I hope you have enjoyed this and you have learned it as well. Those who are new to my channel, then subscribe it and. Don't forget to press the bell icon so that you can get notification about my latest videos. If you have any question, you can ask me in comment section. Thank you for watching.